Did you know the very first 8-bit computer wasn't made of silicon? It was made of wood, string, and punch cards, and it was built in 1804, over 200 years before your laptop. Today, we're talking about Joseph Marie Jacquard, the man who accidentally invented the basic logic of modern computing with a loom. Jacquard was a French silk weaver who wanted to solve one big problem. Weaving complex patterns took forever and required expert artisans. So instead of spending decades training new workers, he tried something radical. He automated the entire process. His invention, the Jacquard loom, looked like a massive wooden machine with hundreds of hooks, threads, and moving parts. But the secret wasn't the wood. It was a program that controlled it. Hanging above the loom was a long chain of punch cards. Each card had holes punched in specific places. And as the machine ran, metal rods would push through some holes and get blocked by others. Sound familiar? This was the first time in human history that a machine followed a stored set of instructions. Every hole was basically a bit. Hole equals one, no hole equals zero. And the sequence of holes told the loom exactly how to move each thread. This wasn't just weaving, it was programming. Jacquard didn't know it, but he'd invented the foundation of modern software. Those punch cards, they inspired Charles Babbage's analytical engine in the 1830s, considered the first theoretical computer. And in the 1900s, they were used by IBM to run early computers. In fact, some computer systems were still using punch cards until the 1980s, all because a French weaver wanted to automate fabric patterns. Jacquard's loom is the perfect example of how old tech can shape the future. A machine built for weaving turned into the blueprint for programming, binary logic, automation, and early computer memory. You could argue that this loom was the first true information processing machine. So the next time you use your laptop or smartphone, remember that its great, great, great ancestor wasn't a machine in a lab. It was a loom in a dusty 19th century workshop. If you enjoyed this video, Follow for more old school tech that changed the world.